Uh, my name's Marcus and um, I had a spinal cord injury about a year and a half ago, which was T5, T6 paraplegia. Uh, since then I've been getting up to a bit of travelling. I've been to Vanuatu, um, travelled around Australia a little bit to Queensland and stuff. And just recently I went to Bali for a scuba diving trip. So um, I actually got into that through Nikki, who's a social worker at the Royal Talbot. And I started off by just doing some swimming down at the pool that she runs. And um, she usually gets people in the scuba diving there. They just, you know, they try it out, see if they like it. At first, I just went there to swim. I didn't want to have a bar of it. I wasn't really interested. Then I thought I'd give it a shot one day. And she kind of lured me down to the idea of um, going to Bali. So I said, yeah, you know what, why not? Might as well do it. Didn't think much of it. Uh, so I went there and actually had a really good time. I ended up getting my license, which took about three days. So I did a bit of study, some trial dives. And um, yeah, when I had my first dive, we went to about 15 metres deep. It was just an amazing experience. It's probably the one thing you can do in a wheelchair that you're the exact same as an able-bodied person. There's complete freedom, there's no limitations. And you just get down and you do the exact same as what everyone else is doing. The only real difference is instead of using fins on your feet, you've got fins on your hands. So manoeuvrability is just great. So um, yeah, I did about seven dives over the course of my trip, which was only for about seven days, seven days. Uh, deepest was about 28 metres, with like the water temperature being at about 28 degrees. So for anyone who's injured, who's worrying about temperature control, it's, that's fine as the water's always warm. Don't have to worry about getting too cold. So um, yeah, I'd probably do it again if I ever had the chance, but maybe not in Melbourne because it's so cold. But um, yeah, it was just a great experience and I think it's just a lesson to keep trying new things. Because even though I wasn't that interested in doing it, it ended up being something that I'd do again. It's just a really great experience. So yeah, just encourage people to just try new things and yeah, highly recommend scuba diving.